watching Who's on Deck. I'm your host, Leah Guy, and today we have a great guest on the deck, Mr. George Duran. You might recognize him as the ham on the street from Food Network, Secret Life of from Food Network, or from TLC, the ultimate cake off. That's right. That's, That's what right. you're doing now, right, George? Well, the, besides the adult videos, uh, yeah. <laughs> I'm sticking, yeah, no, uh, uh, ultimate cake off. Well, I want to do something unique with you today. Huh? Have you ever baked a cake on a grill? Um, you know, I've baked a cake in a, uh, on a campfire, an open fire, but not on a grill per se. Well, we're on the deck. We've got a grill. Yeah. And I want to try to bake a cake. Is it your birthday or anything? Should I know? Should I? No. No, no we're just baking a cake. Mm -hmm. Any I want excuse? to see if it's done, if we can do it. I bet you I can do it. I, I'm, I'm sure I can figure out a way to, to grill a cake. How about okay. That? Let's prep it, get it going, and then I want to find out more about your life. You bet. So, George, do you think we can uh, pull this off? You know, uh, we're... <laughs> First of all, we're working with the finest of ingredients here. <laughs> yes, uh, so And that really helps out a lot, You honestly. really like to cook. Oh, yeah. My goodness, I've been cooking uh, since I was a little child, actually. Really? Um, to a certain extent. Okay, so go ahead and beat that with one of the electric beater beaters. <laughs> this is how I do this one. This is how it's supposed to be. No, I'm kidding. Oh, I was going to say, if you can keep that up <laughs> right, for a so while, that'd be I just want to get this really in there, incorporated. And the reason I didn't put all the, uh, the cake mix, I was going to say flour, but I don't even know if there's flour in there. So. But probably whatever. Not. Um, is because we want to wait to see what the consistency is like, and probably we're going to add all of it. Once I see the consistency there, and this is Jersey City, right? Yeah. Oh, perfect. Okay. I'm, I'm putting a lot of uh, uh, butter on this because uh, I, I don't want it to stick, and chances are it will. So, what I'm going to do is pretty much put very little of the batter in here because the thicker this is, the longer it will take to cook, and that means that it's going to stay for a longer time. But I'm going to kind of see what I'm going to do is kind of make like a pancake batter, but with a yeah. cake instead. And if we had more time and more space, I would just divide this into three pans. Oh, okay. And then have three layers and then kind of layer them together. But we're just going to do one layer for now. How long do you think we should cook it? I think about 10 to 15 minutes maximum. Well, George, you've got a great book. Uh, it's been Thank out you. for a couple of years. Whoops, I'm sorry. I got a little Japanese uh, flavor fine. on it. Take this dish and twist it. If you haven't seen this cookbook, it's one of, it's, it's just unique. It's fun and it's unique. The pictures are great. Yeah. And uh, it's it's been a big hit for you, right? Well, you know, uh, the beauty is that I was able to really put my humor and my personality inside of it. Most importantly, it's a lot of comfort food with twists. So I do things like I make tiramisu from Twinkies, actually. And there's a picture yeah. of my mom in here that I think Aww. you would really, uh, I think your viewers would really appreciate. Here we go. There it is. So um, That's your mom? Yeah. I was able no, to. No, it's not. So, George, what do you think about my little girl? I, you know, I love it because it's electric and there's a lot of places you can't have gas mm -hmm. or charcoal. So this is the way to do it when you need a grill and you can't have any of those. And I think it's cute. Round, small. That, I don't care about that. Blue. It's all about function. For great. Me. <laughs> See, there, we it have, does look great. <laughs> we have a little bit of residual um, stuff that you were grilling, probably the fish that you were grilling <laughs> on the grill. They kind of just splatted on there. But Maybe Don't that. try this look at home, that. folks. And you kind of just spread it a little bit. Hot. Yeah, it's, you got to let it cool off a little bit. But I'm just going to do the corner here so we can get a little taste of it. And it's not bad, actually. I mean, I, I think it seems like you can. It tastes a little like <laughs> tastes a little like corn. Like corn? <laughs> Were you grilling corn? Just I did a day? few weeks ago. Yeah, it, it absorbs any flavor you have in there. So you just go ahead and dig that in and just kind of taste it. It's very moist. Mm -hmm. mm. Can you taste the, um, the partially hydrogenated oils in there? Every one of them. Yeah. But you know what? <laughs> that is good. Yeah, well, that's that, that's our and it's fluffy. Look how fluffy this is. Yeah, that's that's the uh, that's all the maltodextrin and. Well, I think it's the grill cooking and and you, our famous stir, which was you. Yeah. You can try this at home. This is how you make cake, folks. Just don't. <laughs> do, we recommend you don't do it, but I'm going to have a little bit more. Nice, right? <laughs> it's great. Yeah, and then so you could put your shish kebabs on one side, make a cake on the other side. You're done. Brownie, yeah, you're set to go. <laughs> George, I love having you on the show. Thank you so Thank much. You. I appreciate it, Leah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We'll watch for you. Uh, this probably wouldn't win in the ultimate cake off. No, God, you no. Think so? No, not even with taste. What about with just like uniqueness? Uh, college students would love this. If you're a college student out there and you have a grill in the backyard, put this in there. I don't care what you do beforehand, drink, whatever it is that you guys do. You should probably. Um, just, it will taste delicious either way. But it's, um, yeah, it's great. It's probably really good for the skin, too. So you yeah, just kind of put I'm it on, sure on your face like this. And it kind of, oh, look, it's absorbing all the oils. <laughs> don't go anywhere. We'll be right back.